Yeah. What's going on, YouTube community? A Fields are here with y'all on this Tuesday afternoon. And this is not your typical update video where I'm going to be going and on and on. I'm just going to give y'all an update on one thing live streams. Now, as y'all remember, about a month or two ago, I made a video saying no live streams for a while. But now, thanks to some people in a live stream chat I was in about a couple weeks ago, I was introduced to this site, but not necessarily, not necessarily site. I was introduced to this app on my phone where I can live stream. Not only I can live stream on Twitch, um, YouTube, but I can live stream on Twitch too. And I'm really considering giving me a Twitch account. I'm, I'm still on a fence on that. So, you know. So just keep your eyes and ears open in regards to that moving forward, because that could possibly happen. You know, Twitch is seen, Twitch seems to be where it's at now. A lot of people over, over there on Twitch, I know it's a streaming site, and I'm thinking about starting one up, where, you know, I want to, and if I do start one up, it'll probably be before football season, so I can start live streaming games on Twitch, not not showing the games, obviously, but just kind of doing live streams on Twitch for uh, football games and stuff like Florida and um, the Denver Broncos. So I'll keep y'all updated on that. But as far as live streams here on the YouTube, all sisters seem to be a go. So it looks like I can officially live stream again here on YouTube and without having a thousand subscribers. And and I appreciate everybody who subscribed to me the last two or three months via live streams. I know my subscription count has, has went extremely up as of lately. I know about two months ago I had about 463 subscribers. Now today I got 500 and let me check my phone. Alright, so give me one second. Don't please stay off the team. I feel my dear. That was some real foul shit. All right, give me one second, y'all. Okay. There's something else, too. I'm going to go this man. Look, look how he talking to me. He didn't give him... In other words, it wasn't no fair situation. That man didn't have enough time to respond to that man. The public All right, here we go. This, but, you know, the reason why there's no response to the stomp record. I got 551 subscribers now. So I'll, my subscription now almost went up 100 in three months. But y'all already know me. It's never been about the subs or the views for me. It's about just expressing my opinion on certain things. And whether y'all agree with it, that's cool. If you disagree, that's fine. You know, I, you know, I never really buzz off of that shit, you know? But with that being said, Future of the live streams. I think starting my next live stream, I wanted to do one today, but I kind of been sleep the last two hours. So I'm just kind of not really in the mood to really do a live stream right now. But moving forward, I got a new concept for my live streams. You know, hey, you know, everybody has certain names for their live streams. I'm not going to call my live streams live streams anymore moving forward. I got a new name for it. It's going to be called Le Crib. And that's French, you know. L.E. With the boss over here. But yeah, I'm going to call it Le Crib. Because basically, how I look at it, when people are in my live streams, it's almost like inviting them into my house. We having a round table session, you know. We're, we're chatting. Some of us are drinking, you know. Some of y'all are probably smoking, you know. It's, you know, that's how... You know, that's how I feel about my live streams. I feel like it's not it's not really a live stream. It's more so a hangout session one on one. You know, we we have you know, y'all at my house, we you know kinda like kinda like if, if we was all to meet in real life we all met up at somebody's house. You know, that's how I feel about the live streams. So that's what we're gonna start, start calling ah, that's what we start calling it from here on out. The crib. I was also on that note, I'm also got a new name for my mods, you know, you know, some people, you know, 
Yeah, I might do a little change to my mods, you know. So keep it. So stay tuned to that. But yeah, you know how clubs you have bouncers. My mods are my bouncers. That's what I'm gonna call them. And just like an actual job, you know, because you do hire people to be your bouncer at a club. I'm only gonna have few bouncers, okay? I'm not gonna have. Nine percent of my crib. I'm not gonna have nine percent of people in my crib. How they name live in blue? You know you can't you can't do that. You know, uh, you know, because you know you gotta realize some people go mad with power when you give them that. You give them that. So and I don't want people to get mad with power over here because I quick. I'm quick, and I mean quick. Drama draw. To revoke your status away from you if you get if you go mad with power. So yeah, so among that few bouncers, I expect my bouncers to handle their business. With that being said, you know if you see anything that's fu it's funny, and I, I don't mean funny as a comedian, but like on that crazy shit that. That might fuck up the stream. That might fuck up the crib. Gotta get them out of here. Anybody gonna, you know, on that disrespectful shit, throw their ass out. You can't be having that around here, you know? So I expect y'all to step up and do y'all job, okay? Because I will revoke. I will fire you as my bouncer. And also, to anybody who appears in, my, in the crib, and there's not, and that does have their name in blue. Do not, I repeat, do not ask to be a mod. Do not ask to be one of my bouncers, okay? Because that's not gonna make me give you. It's not gonna make me give you bouncer status, you know. You gotta earn me. I know you gotta earn it. But for most people, you gotta earn it. But over here, they put some productions. I do things different around here. I'm not just going to give you... Uh, I'm not just going to make you a bouncer because... I'm not going to make you a bouncer because... I had a brain fart right quick. I'm not going to make you a bouncer just because you appear in my stream, appear in the crib a lot. That's, that's not how I rock things over here. you got to be able to... Cause right now I got I got my bouncers set, so I'm not hiring any bouncers. That's why I say do not ask because I'm not going to give you one right away. Now, it's my get a status revoke or two people get their status revoke, and I'm, I might put out the might put out the AR AR that I may be hiring for new bouncers, which could open up opportunities for anybody who's been here for a long time that I, I believe can do the job to become our next bouncer, so. Now, you know how some people got a name for their comment section? Like H. Camel toes, he calls his comment section the dance floor. I'm calling mine the round table. So when y'all appear in my crib, when you, po when you post a comment, you're officially a part of the, of the round table. You're, you're part of this discussion. There is an open discussion around here. Do not be afraid to open your mouth in the round table session. That's what we're here for. The chat. Right? Also, you got, like I said, you got to respect my round table. You got to be respectful in the round table session. Now, with that being said, I'm giving y'all clearance to say the word subscribe. Like whatever, you can cuss in this motherfucker. You can say motherfucker. You can say bitch ass nigga. If you're black though, don't don't be a white person saying nigga now, all right? But you're black, you, you can say bitch ass nigga in here. Uh, you can cuss my pussy ass nigga because this is Aikos Productions. This is not one of these PC ass motherfucking streams that you be going to. Oh, keep it G rated. No cussing. Fuck that shit. It's hardcore up in this bitch. Because that's how I was raised. I was raised around hardcoreness. I was raised around cussing. So, I'm not going to be like one of those motherfuckers be like, oh, 
no, I don't like cutting myself a motherfucker. I don't, I'm not gonna be like one of these niggas to be like, oh, you can't cut. No, fuck that. If you if you pissed off and you feel like you gotta you gotta cost my you gotta say fuck that shit, then say fuck that shit. You know, you know. So we do around here. Now, y'all already know if you've been paying attention. Only thing I would not allow is anybody calling a female the C-word. Y'all already know what I'm, the C-word is. I do not like that word. I'd rather you call me a bitch than a C-word. I, I just can't stand that fucking word. I wish it didn't exist in the English Dictionary, but unfortunately, it exists. So, yeah, do not call anybody the C-word. And we will not talk politics because I don't got time for any roundtable arguments around here. So, do not... Talk politics. Anything else? It's fair game. As y'all already know, I, like I stated about my, um in the past, you know I don't do sports videos anymore. But we, when the the crib is open, sports talk is a, is um sports talk. It can happen. Damn it! You're allowed to talk sports in the crib. You're allowed to talk about the Broncos. You're allowed to talk about college football. You're allowed to talk NBA, MLB. Hell, you can even talk lacrosse if you want to. We will not talk about the Atlanta United, though. Fuck the Atlanta United. Who cares about them? <laughs> I'll just play. Y'all can talk soccer in here too. I don't. I don't. I don't watch soccer, nor do I give a fuck about it. But if you're if you're into soccer, you know, hey, talk about it. It is what it is. Maybe I can learn something. But yeah, like I said, no politics though. Anything else? Sports, weather, music, TV shows, um, what's going on in, in, in your world? You can talk about your killings. Is, you can talk. Anything else is fair game. If you want to say, if you're talking, if you want to the beach this upcoming weekend, you can say, hey, guess what? Everybody went to the beach this upcoming weekend. You know, everything else is fair game, like Christine Lady's show that comes on at 5 30 Eastern on Fox Sports 1. Because that's how we do around this bitch, Pastor, you know? Safe us productions. Yeah, I just wanted to point that out with y'all and share this with y'all right quick. Like, I'm going to go back to my artwork because I just, you know, like I said, I just kind of woke up, showered up and all that. I just want, want to get back to my artwork. So I did want to drop this jewel right quick because I've been saying since last week I was going to make a video. I told certain people I was going to make a video pertaining to live streams. Let y'all know what to expect moving forward. So you're not lost in the shuffle. So I know a lot of people can easily get lost when you don't tell them something. I, and I hate being, I hate being the person that is always lost in the shuffle. It's like every time I work or, any, or anything that nature, like a lot of people know something that I don't. And I'm always last no shit. I don't like that. And I don't want, I don't want anyone to. And I don't want anybody to feel that way. I don't want y'all to be the last no I want everybody to know at the same time. That's why I'm making this video right the fuck now. So now when I'm gonna I don't know when I'm gonna do another uh do another um live stream. I don't know when I'm gonna open up the crib. I'm probably gonna do definitely try to do one before the month over with. So I'll let y'all know when it's gonna happen. Like and my head on top of a, on top of that's it, I guess. You know, I, I don't really have anything else to say, so I appreciate y'all for tuning in. Y'all have a good Tuesday. Boycott Taco Tuesday. Do not eat tacos today. Do not be a trend follower. Be a trendsetter. Fuck Taco Tuesday. You know, tacos are good. Don't get me wrong. I like tacos too, but I'm not going to eat them on Tuesday. And if uh, people eat them every Tuesday, so y'all need help. I'm sorry, but I I'm caught like I see it. If you eat tacos every fucking Tuesday, you need help. You need therapy. It don't make that. It don't make that much sense to be eating tacos every fucking week, let alone the same date every week. All right. Till next time. A feels up. Signing out. And I'll see y'all later.